Hey there friends, how's it going? Today we are playing BitLife and I just can't wait to be king. I'm gonna live in Spain because, well, I'm now living in Spain and Spain have a king. Ireland does not. Fernando Serrano, that's not a feckin' Spanish name. Dick Tater, now that is a great Spanish name. Royal status commoner, no, no, no. What are we gonna go up to? Will I just go right to Prince so I can, you know, just kill my dad and start making calls? I'm <laughs> customizing, he is 100% Irish. All right, let's start Dick's life. Your name is Dick. Oh, look at him, King Dick. Well, Prince Dick, sorry. Oh my God, I already start with 16 million euros? Oh, why are my parents so young? <laughs> I just got a cheap and purchased real estate worth 10 million. I aged up and I've already earned another 2 million. I've earned another 2 million. God, it's easy being royalty. Nothing's even happening. Look at this. I'm just aging. They just sat him in a room with a bed, a toilet, and some food gets slid under the door every day. I'm going to the headmaster's office for acting up. Insult him. What are you going to do? I'm the feckin' prince. Oh, God damn it! it was the dog that died. <laughs> it's often when the parents died. Oh, I'm depressed and I'm only 10. I'm going to be an angry king. You're mother's suffering from constipation. Okay, good. She's on the way out anyway. I have lice. No, no. Your king wants lice. Settle into royal life. Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. I don't need a driving test. People are going to drive me around. All right, what can I do like as royalty? Mingle with the stars? Choose how to be addressed? Your highness. <laughs> He's just going to be baked all the time. He still looks like a baba. Can we get my father killed so that I can be king? Arrange a hitman to take out the father. <laughs> it's probably a bad idea. Eight grand to kill a king? God, you're cheap. I ran off with the money, for feck's sake. All right, let's try someone else. I'll just put out an open Craigslist post to, to kill the king. They're unable to find a hitman. Oh, maybe next year. All right, hitman. Father. 3,000. He's going by the name of Al Capone. That is definitely a cop. He's willing to kill a king for the price of a big television set. <laughs> Never mind, we'll go next year. The public has denounced you for promoting a royal agenda on a talk show. Uh, denounce them. I do as I please. And that includes getting my father killed. Oh, this kid's called Max Payne. This is a cop, but just feck it. Oh, wait, no. He pulled off the hit on my father using a cannon. God, that was cheap. And I know I'm going to sign up for Instagram. <laughs> Do I need to kill the mother too? Oh, yeah. She's the queen. Okay. All right. Go for the queen this time. Jesus Christ, that's Jason Bourne. Yeah, it seems trustworthy. Hire him. He turned out to be an undercover cop. Oh no, conspiracy to murder. Exert my royal power. You declared to the police officers that you were the prince and should not be treated in such fashion. They all laughed at me. What? They're outraged. The public just announced them. Oh no, 15 years in prison. Moy and associates, you better protect me. 11 years over 15. No, fact that. Not guilty. I got sent. I should have taken the plea deal. God damn it. I'll bribe the guard. I'm protected for five years, but that's not what I wanted. Let's appeal my sentence for 115,000. Yeah, I mean, there you go. Look, it's overturned. All right, now let's look for a hitman that isn't called Jason Bourne. Unable to find a hitman. God damn it. But my depression is gone and my anxiety is gone. <laughs> Funny what getting away with murder will do to you. Oh my God, these names. All right, hire him anyway. He's an undercover cop. What a, what a surprise. I'm amazed. All right, come on, get me out of this. Nine year sentence instead of 15 years. Uh, plead not guilty. You've been found not guilty. Yes. <laughs> My depression is here. Oh, okay. I thought it was gone, but yeah. All right, fair enough. It just played the happy tune and all that. A royal advisor is suggesting that you have two birthday celebrations every year. First with the royal family and then the official birthday celebration with commoners. Uh, celebrate seven times. Speaking of celebration, can I get a hitman to kill my mother? Jane Smith. Is that from a movie? Mr. and Mrs. Smith, perhaps? Or You know what? I trust you. Hire her. Yes, she pulled it off using a spoon. Talented. Attend the queen. Yes, now I'm the king. It's that easy. You inherited 259 million. <laughs> I'm gonna become a YouTuber. <laughs> oh god, the place is feckin' haunted. There's one active ghost here. Jesus Christ. What was that noise? Loretta here sounding like a monster out of Star Wars or something. <laughs> I'm gonna exercise you. Your breathing did sound a bit heavy. It failed. Okay, well, I'm just pissing off the ghost now. Can I buy, like, a massive yacht or something? What's this? Luxury yacht. Yeah, go for it. Well, I don't have a boating license. I'm the king. Oh, sweet Jesus. On what side of the vessel should you pass this marker? Um... Uh, 
Yes, I passed. You could tell by the noises that I was confident in what I was doing and they just gave me the license anyway. All right, luxury yacht. There we go. Buy it with cash. You're thinking about changing its name. What will you do? Oh, uh, uh, that's an easy one. I killed my mom. <laughs> so that name. Your new luxury yacht is now named I killed my mom. But I was found not guilty. There's nothing they can do. They can't try me again, I hope. I'm writing a book. The Confessions of King Dick. Oh, that's doing well. Look at that. I'm earning tons of money. All right, let me do some some royalty stuff. Oh god, I have no respect at all. <laughs> have someone execute it. That sounds fun. Uh, yeah, just a random hippie. Acid bath. Yeah, make it so. Wait, why, why won't you make it so? It, it is by royal decree. Club them to death. Why can't... Oh, there we go. You had a hippie club to death. You had a hippie... Oh, I didn't realize every time I clicked it, I was killing another hippie. Sorry, sorry. I'm using all the kingdom's acid. I know, I'm sorry. But everyone's pretty angry about my hippie the acid attacks. Denounce the criticism. Oh, sorry. Yeah, I clicked it more again. Sorry, I, I forgot. Denounce. Yeah, there we go. We're done. <laughs> We're done with the acid now. <laughs> I'm a bad king. Exotic pet dealer. Um, I was thinking more tiger, not parrot. But feck it, I'll buy him. And his name can be I killed my dad. Why can I not put in spaces? It's not okay. That's fine. It's just I killed my dad. And now when I'm talking to him, I'll be like I killed my dad, and he'll keep repeating it, and then he'll get the blame for it. What else can I do as king other than throwing hippies into acid? I'm celebrity. Mingle with the stars. Who do I want to mingle with? Hey, Betty White, you want to throw hippies in acid? Pick your activity. You invited Betty White to play Call of Duty Warzone with you. She rejected your invitation. Ah, my depression's gone, though. I don't need Betty White. I took my luxury yacht. I killed my mom out for a ride. It's just the subconscious just saying it. That's why he put the name as uh, I killed my mom. So in case it slips out as a confession, you're like, no, no, I'm talking about my, my yacht. Burmese python named Sniper. No, that's an assassination attempt if I've ever saw one. I'm not buying that snake. Plus, I gotta do royalty things like uh, public disservice. <laughs> Are you sure you want to perform a public disservice? I guess so. I initiated mandatory public Zumba classes on the first Tuesday. Day of every month. I'm pissing off the public. Oh, my parrot, I killed my dad. Died at the age of 31. I didn't know he was that old when I was buying him. He was older than me. Support a new law. What is this? Require all citizens to donate a minimum of one body part to signs upon dead if still available. Yeah, I go for it. That sounds like a good idea, actually. Perform some royal duties. You raffled off a night at the palace and donated the money to cancer research. I'm not sure anyone would want to come here. Someone has asked me on a date. A chick I met at the gym. Oh, this is an assassination attempt. No one could possibly want this guy. He's a dick. Tater. You know, gotta watch out for monetization. As long as I, I don't leave the space too long and say he's a dick. Tater. No, I'm fine. All right, reject her and I'll find someone else. No, I don't know anyone. Everyone I know has died. <laughs> All right, love. Maybe we can go on a dating app. Oh, wait, hold on. He met a fan uh, who says he looks better in person than on TV. There you go. <laughs> no condoms are available. Keep going. Worry later. She asked if this makes you a couple. No, I got back to the dating app. I want someone really old because then they're unlikely to kill me because why would they bother? They don't want all that stress. They want to retire. 93. That's what you want. And she does have baggage in the form of children, but they're mostly already dead of old age. So that's fine. Go on a date. Wait, if I go into royalty and execute, can I just straight up execute her? I can. That's mad. <laughs> all right. Disease rats. I don't even know why that's a method, but make it so. Oh. <gasps> Oh my god, it's a dictator. You went too far. She passed away at the age of 93. She died after being executed. Ah, what are the odds, huh? Just skip the funeral. The Spanish people have revolted against you? That was your line? <laughs> when he killed his 93-year-old girlfriend? Insult the Spanish people? Apologize or accept whatever fate comes my way? Um, I don't suppose apologizing will work. Look, I'll apologize. There we go. They forgive me a little bit. You will be stripped of your fortune and exiled to Colombia for the remainder of your life. <laughs> I got an achievement for being exiled and I'm minus $68 million. This doesn't make much sense sense. Like, what did I do wrong? I'm very famous now, though. Could I write a book? <laughs> Let me explain. <laughs> that is the perfect title. I don't have enough money to publish it, though. Oh, I can't even tell my side now. I'll call up Valerie and see if she's still interested. You can't ask your fling Valeria for a booty call because she lives in Spain and you live in Colombia. <laughs> 
Let's just stalk her instead then. Ah, too far. Can we start dating then? It's not too far. Come on. Love knows no bounds. Oh, I vomited in front of everyone at a celebrity event and I've been diagnosed with depression. Is there anything I can do that I like because I'm famous? Maybe I can transition into something else. No talk shows want anything to do with me. There's a nude photo shoot in the forum and yes, sign me up anything for a bit of money. The reception was pretty good considering I'm a former dictator exiled king who murdered countless people. Wait, do I still have my super yacht? <gasps> I killed my mom! <laughs> oh my god, I could make a feckin' profit here, could I? Let me try and sell for 78. Come on, it belonged to that fella from the nudie magazine. <laughs> Post an ad online. Nah. Uh, Alright, try to just make a little profit then. That's not enough! <laughs> like, I'd still be in debt by tens of, uh, well, not tens of millions, but over 10 million, so. No, I'm keeping her. Valeria, would you mind, like, starting some sort of coup to get back my crown? <laughs> I'll give you a compliment. I told her she's a treasure. She didn't really care. Do a TV commercial. You'll give me five grand. Uh, bankers can't be choosers, sure. <laughs> and my fame is going up for appearing in that commercial. I could murder something. That would increase my fame. Well, my infamy, but all publicity is good publicity is what they say. Or I could buy a hat. <laughs> that might be nice too. Oh, that's good. That's nice. Yeah, that's a really good hat. Now they won't know you're the king. All right, clearly my only option here is start a YouTube channel that already has 1.5 million subscribers. <laughs> Fantastic, monetize that. I'm gonna post a video, how to be a king. Did I promote something? Diapers. <laughs> yeah, go for it. <laughs> Following the nude magazine, you know, it just kind of works. He's got a theme. Your fans are demanding that you join Twitter, sure. <laughs> What's up, Twitter world? I'm that king guy who killed my mom and dad and executed all those hippies in that bath of acid. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna have to, like, find a love interest to help me start a coup. Uh, let's go on a dating app. I don't have enough money to use a dating app. Okay, fine. Do it the old-fashioned way, then. Uh, you don't have a lot of money. You're not my type. <laughs> uh, you don't have a lot of money, either. No, not enough money. Not enough money. Not enough money money. No, oh god, that's not enough money at all. Uh, that's a decent amount of money. Yeah, sure. I'm... What the hell is sexsomnia? <laughs> all right, uh, uh <laughs> sounds so made up. All right, uh, told her she's a jewel, and now we'll start a coup. Oh, she won't even get eloped. What's the point then? I thought... I thought you wanted to join me in my coup. Can I have some money? No? What? Oh, my fame is dipping. I gotta do something quick. Uh, wait, what is this? Revenge of the birds. You're out hunting birds on a lake in your luxury yacht. I killed my mom. When a sudden wind knocks you off balance while attempting to correct yourself, the shotgun accidentally fires blasting a hole in the bottom of your boat. Dude, that's all you have. Call the coast guard. Uh, your luxury yacht, I killed my mom's song. And he fecking died. That's the story of dictator. <laughs> Rumor has it, he arranged the murder of his own mother. Now, they were unfounded rumors, but the fact he named his boat and I killed my mom, I do still suspect that there was something to that rumor. Can we undo this with the time machine? Feck, how far do I have to go back? I think I might have to go back to like 23. <laughs> yeah, sure, I'll pay for it. <laughs> this was all a dream. <laughs> ah, yes, it was all a a bad dream there. Okay, so good. This was exactly when I f was found not guilty for... What exactly? Oh, my mom's not dead yet. <laughs> Maybe it's for the best. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe she can, like, take the fall for all my bad deals. Make hunting in cemeteries illegal. No, denounce that law. Oh, now I'm depressed. <laughs> While strolling through the royal gardens early one morning, you come upon a homeless man sleeping behind the rose bushes. Have him arrested for some reason. Oh, no, someone's trolling me on Instagram. <laughs> Ask him to meet you in person. <laughs> they refused. I'm not surprised. I'd have him executed. I'll bring the acid. What paparazzi? So tries grabbing your genitals and attempt to get a reaction? Attack him! Feckin' roundhouse kick his tooth. I missed. Uh, well, that was just embarrassing. <laughs> What the hell is this? Chills run down your spine as you're greeted by a pale blue specter wearing robes from a different era. Sorry about that, that's just me. I'm cold. Just insult the ghost and move on. I Ow. called it an inbreeder and it severed my calf? And now I'm suffering from schizophrenia. Jesus Christ. All right, time to kill my mom. I need to be king. <laughs> I'm clearly the person who should be king right now. I'm ready. I have a lot more life experience this time. Look for a hitman. Catherine, yeah, if I can hire, they're an undercover cop. Sweet Jesus. Not guilty. All right, I, I found out 
not guilty. What a joke of a legal system. You receive a free ticket to see Amy Schumer do a stand-up comedy performance that will be used as a Netflix special. You're feeling the need to laugh really hard. What will you do? Let's lol. <laughs> yeah, that was that was great. Your YouTube account has been hacked and loaded with- What? I lost so many subscribers. Oh, no, no, no. Apologize. Can I hire a hitman to kill my mother? No luck. God damn it. Jesus, her health is 100%. Feckin' hell. Your mother has been diagnosed with diabetes. All right, you know what? I will just uh, water under the bridge. I'm not gonna kill her anymore. Mom, I'm sorry for everything. In fact, so that it's all water under the bridge, mother, I would like to give you... What? I can't give her a box of chocolates? God damn it. Oh, that might be another way of getting her into the grave. All right, let's call a hitman then. An undercover cop. Are you fecking serious? <laughs> I keep trying to exert my royal power, but they always laugh at me. God damn it. I got actually sent to prison this time. Can we just appeal this? Uh, you, the expensive ones. You lost the appeal. Oh. All right, I guess that the prince can stay in jail for a decade or so. Wait, I got attacked and they cut my tooth. How did, How can you cut a tooth? <laughs> and in in the prison's minimum security wing tells you it would be an honor to make you something. Oh, a wooden throne. That'd be lovely. Oh, yay. An inmate offered me royal protection. How much do I have left in my sentence? <laughs> Why is my behavior bad? I got six years left. Ah, uh, fine. You're up for parole. Yes. They asked the following question. What would lead you to get arrested again? A sexy but evil influence. <laughs> what does that mean? I'm not sure. Yes, I got released. Whatever that means, I got released. They're like, you know what? Fair enough. The mother's still alive. Jesus Christ. Christ almighty. Maybe I should just try and kill her myself. That might be a better call because everyone seems to be a cop these days. I'll put on a disguise first, okay? <laughs> it works for Superman. They'll never know it's me. Murder. Uh, let's see. You club them? Poison them? That's a very royal way of doing it. She died! Yay! I am being arrested. <laughs> All right. They'll defend me for nearly a million euros. Yeah, sure. It's the public's money. It's not mine, really. I've been convicted of murder and sentenced to life in prison. C can I appeal this by any chance? You lost the appeal. The system is feckin' rigged against me. I still have my hundred million dollars. At least there's that. I would like to escape now, please. <laughs> da -dum. 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 Da -da 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 -dum. <laughs> <laughs> we got out. Can I do royal stuff still? No, I can't. Okay. Law review. Oh, I can still do stuff? I got arrested. <laughs> what? Just because I showed up at the palace and started reviewing laws? I would like to appeal. Now that I've escaped, I can appeal again. I lost the appeal. What a surprise. All right, I guess we have to escape again. It's the same prison they put me in. All right. Oh, it didn't work this time. I did kind of half-ass the tune, I suppose. Run, dude. Yes, I'm out. I'm going to ban mobile games. <laughs> I just get out of prison, ban Candy Crush, and then flee. I just want to make an impact. I can't emigrate while I'm the prince. God damn it. What if I just get loads of plastic surgery? Gender reassignment. Here I come. Yeah, I go for it. It was botched, and I died. <laughs> oh my god. He's so unlucky. Well, actually, no. I think it was more the choices I made along the way that cursed him. His royal funeral was attended by a handful of devoted followers. Really? The entire population of Spain. They could only find a handful of people. A strapping and unruly young man. He was born into Spanish royalty. Dick spent many years of his life in and out of jail. <laughs> Everyone discovered he was a worthless and loathsome individual after he killed his own mother. He was not happy and his karma was bad. All right. Well, I guess we will leave it there. Maybe I'm just not cut out to be king. No, no. No, it's, it's the game that is wrong. Uh, I hope you enjoyed. If you did, uh, consider subscribing. We'd love to have you around. Thank you all for watching, and I hope to see you next time. Bye for now.